Hey everyone, just going to give you another uh, product review on some LED lights. Now these lights come from a subscriber of mine and also from a guy who lives pretty local to me. And so it was actually, it worked out really cool. I was able to actually meet up with him and uh, he hooked me up with a couple lights and gave me an extra light that I could use as a giveaway. When this experiment is all done, I'll be giving away a grow light to one of you. And I'll let you know a little bit later on how you can uh, win the grow light. But for now, I just want to get started. I, I am not growing indoors at the moment because I'm out in the microgreens palace. But I set up just one light with just one tray to grow inside to see how it does. And I didn't set it up the way uh, Brad is his name would have suggested. He would have liked the light, I think, a lot further away. But we're going to give it a go and see how it does. So the, the company that hooked me up with this light is called Hidden Harvest Grow Lights. And I will put a link to their website in the description. And also a link to his YouTube channel. So you can check out what he's got going on. So I'm just going to give it a quick run through. See how I like it. See how it goes. I'll show you a little bit about what's going on right now. This is the grow light. It is LEDs. He's got multiple color spectrums in there. He's got a pattern he likes that he thinks works really well. This light only draws 36 watts, which is awesome. That's like really low power. And I have a tray of radish underneath it. These are Hanvit radish. And we'll see how they do. I just unstacked these. These were stacked for three days. And I, I stacked them outside in the greenhouse. I just brought this in. I just barely unstacked it. And so I'll keep some updates. And as I update, I will let you know how you can win yourself a grow light. All right, this light has been on for about 18 hours now. It's performing very well. Radish is looking great. Got some nice color. It's amazing what a difference 18 hours of being under the light can do for microgreens. So I'm going to shut this light off for six hours and then uh, turn it back on for another 18 and I'll update you. Day two under the lights. Another, uh, they've been on for about 16 hours or so. And these, after two days of being under this light, are pretty much ready to harvest. I'm going to wait until tomorrow to harvest them, but yeah, the light did great. No complaints. All right, so that's going to be it for this uh, little experiment. I just wanted to get an idea for how these lights work out, and they work just fine for microgreens. I'd still be curious to see how high up they could be, how far away. I know that Brad has uh, his growing quite a, quite a ways away from his plants and they're doing great, but he's growing bigger plants like tomatoes and uh, peppers and cucumbers. Uh, go ahead and make sure you check him out. I'll put his uh, link in the description and I'll also put my email in the description. And if you want to win one of these lights, uh, send me an email, let me know if you uh, you want a light, why you want it, and, and such. And uh, next week, next uh, maybe Friday or Saturday, I will uh, draw the winner and I will ship you a light. So my email is brabantfarms at gmail.com. I'll put the Hidden Harvest Grow Lights link in the description and also for his YouTube channel. So go ahead and check out Brad. Thanks again, buddy, for the lights, and I hope somebody gets a free light and they enjoy it as well.